Hi, I'm Ben Pearlson, Senior Innovation Manager here at the DHL America's Innovation Center. I'm standing here in front of our brand new robotics and automation centerpiece cell, what we're calling an introduction to lights out logistics. This cell is a combination of many different robotics and automation applications so that regardless of what sector or industry you're coming from, they'll be able to find some kind of value here, whether it's with our mobile robotics demonstration, mixed case depalletizing, or even teleoperation systems. There's something in here that everybody can find value in and learn from. The reason we wanted to highlight robotics and automation as a part of our centerpiece is because all of our customers and all of our operations are finding value and looking towards automation to help support operations from both the staffing and productivity and even a safety perspective. One of the biggest pieces about this robotic cell is the mixed case depalletization capability powered by Plus One Robotics AI software. This system also has embedded safety features that further allow the robot to actually collaborate. Meaning as I get closer to the robot, it's actually going to slow down or even stop if I get too close to the robot. As I back away, the robot's going to then go back into full speed, allowing for a more seamless integration into our customers' operations. So here we have a mobile industrial robot capable of carrying 600 kilograms. This system is going to autonomously move and replenish pallets to close an entire cycle. So what used to be a tedious and repetitive task can now be done fully autonomously. And all at the same time, this system is able to operate following safety limits, speed zones, to optimize it for human-robot interaction. As the robot moves, it's able to travel long distances fully autonomously following fixed infrastructure that your site already has without needing to make significant changes to the operation from where it is today. This robot specifically can carry up to 600 kilograms, while there are systems for all different sizes of product and categories. With simple pallets or boxes like this, the AI vision is never going to get confused. But for the sake of demonstration, we're going to go ahead and trick the robot into thinking that it doesn't know how to operate and show you what that actually looks like. When the robot doesn't know how to pick, someone sitting anywhere in the world is going to see exactly what the AI vision overhead sees. And that person is going to tell the robot exactly where it should pick that piece, select it, confirm that's where they want it to go. The robot is then going to complete the pick. The great thing about that is anytime this happens, the robot is actually learning from that. So in real time, or the next time the robot comes up to that similar situation, it'll have a better chance at making the proper pick. 